Hi guys, I haven't, um, I haven't filmed in a while because, I don't know, with that camcorder, yes, back to my, back to camera and camcorder. When I had that camcorder, it was just so bulky that I wasn't really having fun with it. I mean, it was a good quality camcorder, but the guy said, you know, check it out and, um, and see how I like it for a week. He gave me from Saturday to Saturday and today's Saturday and... Although the, um, the quality of it was really nice, I actually did not like how um, it was easily um, filming. It didn't have a stabilizer, so it was moving around a lot. So I actually went back to the original camera that I had. I went to Best Buy today, and turns out they are no longer um, making those um, power shot elf 110 they're discontinuing them uh, online didn't have any more so I ended up um, having to upgrade to a power shot elf 130 is and that's what I have now and this is the one that I got it's the titanium it looks like uh, titanium silver has Wi-Fi um, capability of this one and I'm actually looking at the screen and it actually has really nice clear um, screen quality and wanted to show you guys just a little bit of what I did today with the kitties um, went to Best Buy went to Target and I wanted to show you guys what I got at Target really quick just um, really basic simple stuff I'm gonna do a makeup haul and this is gonna be part of the makeup haul so I don't want to talk too much about it but these were all clearance items from Target that I'm gonna go ahead and add on to my haul later on tonight if I could do it um, love this for my um, my deodorant the Dove um, clinical protection got our staples of our toothpaste I didn't like the toothpaste that we got last time I think it was the it was a it wasn't Colgate I think it was Aquafresh, but it was the orange and white. Um, I don't know what the flavoring is, but I wasn't too happy with it. These are basically my staples. So these are the kids' shampoo. I like it because it's it smells good. Um, big kids, not the um, not Danny. Danny still uses the um, kitty version, and I love this one, Saint Ives um, Energizing Citrus. Smells so refreshing. And I tried the one that was uh, exfoliating. I didn't care much for that one. I like the plain one. And this one is just a, you know, it's just a cheapy, um, not drugstore, but Target. Target has it. And this is $3. I also like to use the Dove uh, body wash. But the Dove body wash tends to run around $6. And this is just uh, a little over $3. So half the price. Smells so good. And I'm very happy with this one. And hubby for his breakfast. Um, he likes to eat these um, breakfast bars. And so got them. Really affordable, cheap price. Like $2.50 over at Target. And I wanted to talk to you guys about this. So I took a picture of it with my camera. Which I will include when I upload this. And there is this new product now and I just became aware of it the last time I used it um, I went to Target and it's one of those um, fabric instead of the dryer sheets it's those um, dryer bars that you just stick inside the dryer and it's supposed to work for like up to three months or up to four months I think and it costs like about almost seven dollars so I bought one last month and I am so unhappy with it that it's still in the dryer but I needed to to add some extra um extra what do you call these the dryer sheets in there because it's just my um hubby's basketball shorts he showed it to me yesterday and it's just clinging on to him so I did not want to replace it for the fact that you know it's it was pretty expensive, but I figured that I'd just get the Target store brand instead of using my regular bounds. And just basically um, add this onto what I already have. So maybe that will work. Because this one was only $3 compared to the bounds that was almost $6. Okay, so try that out. 
And then I got me my coffee. Oh, I, well, it's pretty. It's open at the bottom. But um, my coconut mocha. Oh, just love this. I this is like candy to me. And as you guys can see, we are down to just these. And these are not even coffee. These are basically flavored, flavored coffee, more of a milk base. And still have our um, dark chocolate. And <laughs> hubby, hubby is not even drinking these anymore. He prefers the um, the electrical tea kettle that I have, and he's always constantly asking me to make um, tea. The he loves the Tivana tea, and I've been doing that for him. So he's been abandoning these, and he'll only drink this when I <laughs> when I can't make him his um, tea kettle teas, or if I'm not home, and then he'll pop this one into the into the Keurig our little breakfast buddy but um so I had to go to Target today and get some more because we are totally out of coffee and I wanted to check this out because um hubby wanted some dark rose and I love um Starbucks brand uh we actually had the I think it was the breakfast blend last time and that went pretty quick as well but this one was something that I really needed so I'm actually going to pop one in now. I'm going to pause the video so I can clean up my, my counter mess. But I'm going to show you guys a trick that one of my subscribers showed me. See, I'm always learning from you guys. Totally love it. But um, before I do that, look what I got in the mail today. So um, before I... I decided that before I went into um, Tivana again and order some more some more tea because we are almost out of, of the youth berry and totally out of the which one is that the peach tranquility i wanted to um to try something else also um other loose teas and this one is not loose though um the republic of tea doesn't have a lot of loose tea um varieties i think they only have five so this is a tea bag but i still wanted to go ahead and check out what they got but before i tell you guys what i ordered i want to make sure that um i filmed it i filmed it so i can show you guys the unboxing of this let me clean up my counter and then i'm gonna make myself coconut mocha okay see you guys in a bit all right while well, my water is um heating up i just turned it on went ahead and popped in my donut shop my coconut mocha I am so excited for that and over at my target they had you know my um peppermint mocha which I was surprised that they still had so I grabbed one I love this during the winter and and then this is my new favorite so I discovered this when I think when I first got the Keurig last month and it it's it's going to be a staple product basically for our um coffee the reason I love this so much is because it's just sweet cream. So when I have a flavored um, flavored coffee, just like this one, which is um, coconut mocha, if you put coconut mocha along with peppermint, well, actually peppermint and coconut oil can go together. But it, you know, for the ones that don't go together, then it's kind of it, it'll kind of taste weird to blend two. Uh, two strong flavors together but this one which is the sweet cream this actually goes well with the flavored coffees so we usually get a lot of flavored coffees we get a um, the coconut mocha we have gotten toffee something toffee we have gotten the Kahlua and I am there was another one I can't re recall what it is but sweet cream cold stone sweet cream seems to work um, along with with all the uh, different flavored coffees that we have gotten so far and these this one the peppermint mocha hubby will probably most likely use that one with his um with his um dark rose starbucks and oh it's ready so it's all ready oh i wanted to show you guys this is the reason why i had it so i wanted to show you guys a trick i already opened it up a trick with um with making my cup of coffee in the morning or with me throughout the day but um one of our subscribers 
um, showed me this trick to basically go ahead and put your cream in and put it in here and then start brewing up your coffee because I usually do it and then I'm going to go ahead and press um, I like it strong so I'm going to put it into the middle one and then start I usually add on my sugar and cream afterwards but with this one I don't need I don't usually add sugar I just add this one and I usually do it afterwards and then I stir it up but what she showed me was like um, do this beforehand before putting it um, before um, turning on my Keurig because what happens is it will automatically mix itself up you don't have to use the spoon so I thought that was a pretty cool trick and ever since she told me I've been doing that so thank you and while we are waiting for my coffee which is actually done it's pretty fast that's what I love about it I wanted to show you guys the magazine that I picked up at Target today I used to have a subscription for this but it done expired so I wanted to buy this one because of course it says um, back to basics beauty which really caught my eye and I love the cover but I wanted to um, see if there was a special they usually have specials like uh, renewing your subscription and this one says a five dollar special discount off our regular mail-in rates so that's pretty cool I'll go ahead and do that and wanted to show you guys that and then let me turn this off and show you guys what I got from the Republic of Tea. Be right back.